So what we're doing right now is deflection of the lower limb. It's called lower limb, and that includes the lower part of the leg, that is called the fetlock, the pastern, and the coughing joint. So right there we are flexing the fetlock, the pastern, and the coughing joint. We're gonna wait for about 30 seconds, and then he's gonna say one, two, three, and he's gonna start running. To get a reference image against the wall, It's going to be a very, very interesting radio graph. One, two, three. This horse worse or better or not change than when we started the examination. We can see that this horse is a little worse. So we definitely have some pain going on right there. So we know for sure that we're going to take some radiograph x-rays like people call it out of the left front fed look now we're gonna do the right front fed look as well One, two, three. the right front lower limb flexion when you look at him going i want you to get a reference image against the wall so you can see if the head is going down or the head is going up and you can also look at the hip that's going to give you indications that the horse is actually lame. I like to look at reference images. A horse that is sound or not lame will actually not jump. It will go smooth throughout your reference. One, two, three. Another thing that I want you to pay attention is at the stride, how the horse brings the leg forward or back, forward or back when he walks or trots and also how that fellow drops to the ground. Let's pay attention to those. Ready? One, two, three. <laughs> so, Right here, what we're doing is upper limb flexion of the left hind. Upper limb flexion of the left hind. This is actually a very non-specific flexion, and we are flexing the hock, the stifle, and a little bit on the hip joint, okay? However, it's very informative because you are going to see if the horse is lame on those areas, it's gonna have quite a bit of a hip hike or change in the way the leg goes forward or change in the way the leg goes back. So pay attention to those things every time you look at a horse now. From now on, you never look at a horse the same way. Now I'm gonna add a level of complexity to the examination. Another sense that we use is the ear. We listen to the rhythm of the horse going and also the impact. Some legs are gonna be landing harder than others. For example, the leg that feels good is gonna land harder than the legs that doesn't feel good. Why? Because he's trying to avoid putting weight on it. So now we're gonna also add a level of complexity, another sense to the lameness examination and that's gonna be the ear. short stepping on the right hand. So that was a positive, a positive flexion. Mildly positive, not horrible, but a positive flexion. This is gonna be a very, very interesting radiograph that's gonna come out. So I want you to be there for when it pops up in the screen.